So in today's video guys we're gonna have a look at the latest uh, drop coming from Nike and this one will be the most expensive uh, pair of uh, trail running shoes. Hello guys and welcome back for a brand new review. If you are new to the channel, please make sure you're gonna press the like button and maybe also subscribe to the channel. You can also give me a follow on Instagram and TikTok to see exactly what I'm gonna review in the next few days. In today's video guys, we're gonna have a look at the latest drop coming from Nike for a pair of uh, trail running shoes. So let's go ahead and take them out of the box, which as you can see will come in your usual box uh, coming for this uh, trail range, which usually will come in this uh, brown box, which will have this uh, big Nike swoosh in this uh, black color here on top. And as you can see at the front and also on the sides and at the back, we're gonna have the same uh, design, which we've been getting in the last couple of years. But opening the actual box inside we're gonna have this uh, I would say topographical design for this paper which yet again it's something usual and also besides this uh, paper guys we're also gonna have these uh, three uh, stickers usually before we were getting just one but for this one as, as it's gonna be slightly a bit more expensive we're gonna get uh, three stickers which again it's a nice uh, addition so let's go ahead and just uh, take the shoes out guys so in today's video we're gonna have a look at the most expensive pair of uh, trail running shoes coming from nike and this one guys will be the zoom x uh, ultra fly trail This one uh, popped into my feed on Instagram guys around uh, two weeks ago and I need to admit that I was actually quite interested in, in this uh, drop. So we finally got it here in UK in the last uh, couple of days of uh, July for the retail price of uh, 230 pounds guys which will be around the 250 US dollars and I need to admit that this one even though it doesn't look like it will have a lot of uh, new technology so I guess that's why this one will be more expensive so let's go ahead and read a few words from the Nike website so apparently this will be a championship uh, trail racing uh, shoe which uh, Nike is introducing for the first time a carbon uh, fly plate which will be layered uh, between a Zoomex foam and a neat uh, fabric uh, wrapped midsole and this one will uh, sit on a rubber uh, Vibram outsole which will have a sticky rubber that works with a chevron log uh, pattern to provide grip on both uphill climbs and downhill descents and for the upper guys we're gonna have this vapor weave mesh which will provide a very good breathability and also a good protection against water so let's go ahead and also do a breakdown of this one guys so as you can see for this upper we're gonna have this vapor weave mesh material which looks like a ripstop one so most definitely i feel that this one is actually quite thin and also quite breathable as well so this vaporwave material will be present for all of this upper and on top we're gonna have some fused materials. So as you can see here in the midfoot for the lateral side we're also gonna have this very big Nike swoosh in this black color. And just above it we're gonna have this Nike trail racing written and also vaporwave. But as you can see on the medial side uh, we don't have that uh, big Nike swoosh, we're gonna have this uh, Nike trail um, logo. And here in the midfoot guys underneath this uh, Nike swoosh and also this uh, uh, trail logo we're gonna have this uh, orange uh, material which will have actually quite big uh, holes uh, to give a good breathability. So these ones I would say that it will work as an inner cage which uh, most definitely when uh, tightening the actual shoelaces uh, will wrap your foot quite good as in for the actual lacing system guys uh, this is something which we've seen before in the trailer running shoes which will keep in place these thin white laces and uh, these laces guys will also have uh, some very nice uh, and interesting uh, designs for these uh, uh, tips 
which for sure are looking quite nice and just underneath these laces guys uh, we're gonna have the same vaporwave uh, material for this uh, tongue which underneath uh, will have a decent amount of padding and as you can see here at the top we're gonna have a very nice uh, uh, finish for these uh, borders where you're also gonna have written Nike Ultra Fry Trail and on the other side we're gonna have this uh, orange dots and this uh, tongue guys uh, will actually be a uh, fully gusseted so most definitely i feel that this one it's uh, gonna provide a, an even better uh, locking system here in the midfoot going now inside of the shoe guys for this one we're gonna have this uh, white lining which underneath will have a decent amount of padding but nothing special and also at the bottom we're gonna have this uh, foam insole in this uh, white and blue colorway which also have written here at the heel section nike trail in this black color finishing now at the back of the shoe guys for this one we're gonna have a very simple uh, design where we're gonna have this very small uh, tab in this orange color with this uh, trail logo so now guys we can go to this uh, very interesting uh, zoom x uh, midsole which will be uh, wrapped in this uh, the neat uh, fabric uh, material which to be honest has a very nice and aggressive uh, design and this one inside guys apparently will have a carbon fiber uh, plate so i guess that's why the, this one will be uh, on a more expensive side so as you can see on the lateral side we're gonna have uh, this uh, nike zoom x written while on the medial side we're gonna have written a fly plate so most definitely i feel that by having this uh, wrapped midsole uh, this one will uh, protect uh, the actual uh, zoom X uh, underneath but in the same time I feel that uh, this material will uh, be as a magnet uh, for a lot of um, elements uh, from the actual trails so I'm not entirely sure that this is the best uh, way to protect this uh, zoom X midsole but I guess it is what it is so now guys we can finish with this uh, orange rubber outsole which will be a Vibram one so as you can see this one will have a very interesting uh, design where uh, here at the front uh, we're gonna have this uh, traction lugs which will also be present here at the heel section and i would say that at least comparing with other pairs of uh, nike trail running shoes these lugs are actually not that raised but i guess uh, this is just enough as in for the actual sizing guys for this one i went with my true to size and for me as i have a skinny fit this one fits me just fine and i would say that it's gonna be roughly the same for people with normal feet but i would say that for people with uh, wide fit guys you should either go with your true to size or even try a half size up just to make sure that this one is not going to be too tight for you one thing which i will need to add is that for me as i have a skinny fit i feel that this actual toe box it's a bit on the wider side but i didn't find that to be a problem when actually running on the trails i feel that sometimes i need to have a bit of a wiggle room so overall guys this uh, brand new release uh, coming from nike for this uh, ultra fly uh, zoom x in my opinion it's actually looking quite nice and it also feels quite good underfoot of course uh, most of these releases which will have this zoom x uh, midsole will be very comfortable and it will feel actually quite uh, squishy underfoot but as this one it's gonna be a competition pair of shoes uh, which will also come at a higher price of 230 pounds here in the uk at least for this one we're gonna have that carbon fiber plate which most definitely will help a lot I really felt that this one uh, has a very good uh, spring effect which will help you in propelling uh, towards your next uh, step so for sure i would say that this one it's uh, a very good option out there uh, for uh, longer runs or even uh, competition runs but you just need to keep in mind that this one is going to be uh, a bit more expensive than most of the releases out there so yeah guys uh, this was my unboxing and reviewing of this uh, brand new release coming from nike for this uh, zoom x uh, ultra fly uh, trail i really hope you've enjoyed this video and if you did uh, don't forget to press the like button maybe also subscribe to the channel you can also give me a follow on instagram and tiktok to see exactly what i'm going to review in the next few days and as always i will see you in my next one thanks for watching